How's it going, guys? Well, rainy, crappy day out, kind of cold. But I uh, just realized just yesterday when I was going to work that I actually put the wheels on the wrong way in the next time. And by the wrong way, I don't mean like front to back or side to side, I mean backwards. Well, there's uh, some, some tire, the tires nowadays, they, uh, they have something called directional uh, tread. And um, let me see right there. You see how those little curves right here are um, like pushed inward? See how it's curved in? That's so when the water hits it, it goes out. It's for um, uh, traction, uh, traction and all that fun stuff. But if I can find it, it says it on the wheel. Not the wheel, but it says it on the tire. Right here, you see where it says rotation with the two arrows going this way, and that's the front of my truck. So these tires are spinning backwards. I just realized this yesterday. I did the arrow with that was right at the top of the wheel, and I just happened to look down and I was like, "Oh, that's cool." I uh, put the wheels on backwards. So I'm just gonna swap that. Just the two front sides. That's all. The driver, and passenger, and I'll fix that. Because uh, somebody put smaller tires on the wheels, the same t same size rims, but those are all 195 uh, 60s, I believe. Uh, 195 60 15s. The backs are two somethings. Two, 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 two something. If I can find. Uh, two fifteen sixty fives. So a little, they're taller and uh, a little bit skinnier in the back. But I haven't checked the back. I do not think the back is directional. If it doesn't say if it doesn't say rotational thread or anything tread or anything like that, then most likely they're not directional. And uh, these are not directional tread. But the, see how there's a uh, tread facing both ways. That's for um, that's like a truck tire. My dad's. I can I can show you on my dad's Colorado. It's the uh, his are kind of like that. The tread goes both ways on on his tires, front and back. That's for like snow, all all season basically. Those uh front tires are like I think mud and snow. Yeah, mud and snow, and then all season. But yeah, I'm just gonna swap these around. I figured I'd give you a, a little, uh, a little uh, how-to video slash um, little lesson on tires. Now the uh, same goes for our uh, motorcycle tires too, actually. Like, uh, let me show you on the Suzuki. Right there, you see how it says uh, rotation. Same thing with these treads here. I don't need a flashlight for that. When the rain comes in and hits it, it's it's gonna come zigzag through here and then right out. Motorcycle tires are designed, I think, a little bit more because you're on two wheels, not four. And same goes for the back. The back tires the same exact way. All these lines do. These lines are made just for like. They're made for a purpose to not just show. See right there, it says drive with the arrow facing forward. So, <clears throat> yeah. There's uh, the um. <clears throat> now, uh, obviously, if you have them backwards like I do, the uh, 
you might get a little bit worse gas mileage. You're definitely gonna mess up the tread in your tires. But these tires here are just like kind of like I get the rest of the season. I, have a, I might drive them a little bit in the spring, but I doubt it. I'm gonna get uh, a little bit fatter tires for the back, and I'll probably keep about the same size for the fronts. I might actually. The fronts are kind of small, so I might actually get a little bit bigger in the front. I might go a little bit taller and fatter in the back, and I might go a little bit taller in the front because those are a little small in the front. But I like I love the look of the truck, so it's going to be like that for now. But yeah, let me get this jacked up and get these damn things swapped around. So, yeah. That's about it for this uh, old tech technical uh, video.